Probably like to go to that. Like to go to the green bin. Yeah. He probably thinks there's food in that. We never thought we'd be goat herders, but here we are. You can let him go, he's okay. Meadow's feeding for us. We feed. <laughs> we feed enough hay. Keep the horses happy through this very hot weather streak. And it keeps them in their sheds. That was fun. Okay. And it's doing better, I think. <sighs> Which is a good and a bad thing. The bugs were just really bothering her. So we're gonna work on that. Hi Alexa. Be good girl. She's also looking for her tea. Oh, why? We are in a heat wave right now till about August 15th. It's about two and a half weeks. So, I haven't found a chicken coop yet because, okay, you be nice, Judy. You be nice. I'm gonna give you some, some more water. Yeah, back up, Judy. So what I do is, Wherever they have made these little divots in the ground. Oh. Here. A little cold water. They like to go behind here because it's nice and cool. So what I could do is move this a little bit. I almost was able to get a chicken coop, but 
They sold it from underneath me, of course. So this is Spirit. She has more red than white. The rooster is a Banta rooster, and his name is Judy. Because that's one of the ghosts in Scooby-Doo. And I thought it was cute for a boy. food and they have this water and then I'm gonna make sure they have plenty of if you don't like that it'll cool them off and on their feet here's their little chicken coop they do kind of roost in there at night <laughs> it's too small um Daphne and Velma, one is a red, that's Daphne. She has the more red and Velma has the more black on her back. And then this one is Spirit. She has more red than white. And the one with more white than red is Ghost. There we go. I'm on the hunt for a chicken coop. Big one. And one we can move without a freaking forklift. We'll find it. I'm on the prowl. Got a fire going on near Loveland in the mountains. A couple of towns have been evacuated. arena pulled. Now we have to pull the other half. Got a little bit out of control. So, want to go graze the horses for a little bit. Just hanging out with them. Today is 100 degrees. Tomorrow is 100 degrees. One more week. Then we'll have some 80s. Which will nice give us a break these hundred three days are tough rangers getting better when miles is taken out to grace Take panned out a little bit to graze. Chakra, get out. Out. Come. Come on. Dallin's gonna clean tomorrow morning. We did waters today.
Hi. Okay, Panda, I'm just letting him go for a walk a little bit. Yeah. This is smoke from Colorado fires. This is Park, Loveland, Berthoud, and near like Conifer for four of them right now. We're so bad. Everyone's evacuating in the foothills. It's just so 
hot right now and dry. I see lights. Right down there. Watch. I would open up my barn to horses and livestock, but I have I have no fencing. My only fencing is right there, and I don't have enough for. I'm gonna put a round pin right here, but I don't have enough fencing to put horses in the night and out during the day. Right here, I want to put up a turnout. Right here, I could put out a turnout. All this is grass that is still dry. That's something worthy. This is that weed that I was afraid was too toxic for animals, but I guess it's okay, except can be toxic for cattle. All this in the outdoor arena is summer cypress that we're pulling out. And all this is this weed that just takes over. So once the heat kind of goes away, We'll get to mowing some of that. This all has to be weed whacked because there's a bunch of tree trunks and stuff there. So we've been mowing all this other stuff down, but can't mow in the indoor. And we'll have to get to this. It's gonna take a minute and go. Oh. We did all this over here behind the barn over there. It's a work in progress. We should look up at those lights.